Hey, it's Jobber here. Gonna be doing an opening of the Dimension of Chaos, a booster box. It just came out. I'm super excited. I'm about to head over to the San Jose YCS. I'm actually gonna be literally leaving in like three hours to go there. But I wanted to do this opening for you guys so you have a chance to check this out. And if you enjoyed this video, please post a comment below. Like, subscribe for more. And on that, let's get cracking. There are some super amazing cards in here. Um, a Cosmo Destroyer is one of them. It's like a $130 card. Uh, Magic Specters is some really cool cards like Raccoon and whatnot, so we're hoping for that. Really looking forward to this YCS. If you guys are going to be there, say hi. I'll be uh, I'll be hanging out there Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So, <laughs> and uh, alrighty, so let's see what we get. I'm gonna be trying to do some vlogs while I'm there as well, so I think that'll be cool. And some pretty cool cards in this set overall. There's a, they really give a lot of support to uh, Cosmos 100%. And the Magic Specter is one of their counter trap cards. Really fun deck. A lot of my friends are going to be playing Cosmos. Here's one right here. <laughs> that is awesome. <laughs> Love this card. Probably one of my favorite cards of the set. That's so cool. So, uh, yeah, if you guys are going to be at the, at the YCS in San Jose, should uh, drop and say hi to me. I'll just be walking around. Don't be shy. I love to say hi to people. I'll be wearing, uh, on Saturday, I'll be wearing my Team Jobber t-shirt, so I'm really excited about that as well. Oh, cool, our first Super Rare. Actually, a really cool uh, 1850 generic uh, three-scale four-star monster pretty awesome Our first foil put that right there <laughs> that's awesome actually a really good card too and you destroy you can special summon uh, a performance from your deck so really really good card it's gonna be a lot of decks that YCS that are gonna be playing that as well so watch out for that Still only one super rare so far. Really excited to see what uh, secret we pull. I really hope that we pull uh, Destroyer. And the reason why, well, well one, because the card's super expensive, <laughs> but uh, my friends actually really need it. So I'm hoping to pull some for my friends. That'll be really cool. I'm actually going to be splitting a couple of cases with them. So I'll be uh, opening up some booster boxes in the hotel room last second to hope that we get all the cards that we need for the deck. In fact, I think a lot of people are probably going to be doing that since uh, the set just got released pretty much a day before the event. That makes it a little bit hard. The right side of this box is being a little, <laughs> a little elusive. Sometimes when that happens, we'll uh, end up pulling the secret rare or something. So, oh, cool! Uh, Metrovector Cyclone. This is one of the cards you run in that deck as well. You tribute off one, and you can destroy one monster your opponent controls. And then it's fine, they're all pendulum monsters, so it's just you tribute them off, and then next turn, or possibly if you already had it there, you can uh, pinch on someone to back that turn, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, Grand Horn of Heaven's actually a pretty cool card, too. It's kind of like the, almost like the new Black Horn. Your opponent gets to draw a card, I think, on the end phase. It's a pretty decent card. They also lose a phase too. So if, it, if they did it on their main phase two, it puts them into their end phase. Or if they do it right in their main phase, it puts them into their. And it basically skips the next phase. So so what? I uh, skips that phase. So we'll put them into battle phase. It's a pretty cool card. Interesting at least. Oh, cool! Is our uh, ultra a super soldier shield? Really cool. Pulled uh, three foils on that side. Looks like everything's going to be on the left, hopefully. A secret rare. Uh, hopefully an ultimate rare. Sometimes those ultimate rares are a little... Oh, sweet! Exactly what I need for my deck. Uh, I'm playing Magic Spectre, so you guys know. So, uh, yeah, I need three of these guys. Three raccoons. Uh, it's basically like the Stratos of the deck. You can summon it and add one Magic Spectre monster from your deck to your hand. So, really, really, really good. 
And uh, Fox right here, a really good card as well. Uh, you can add one uh, trap card from your deck to your hand. And they're all pendulum monsters, so it's pretty cool. Another super rare, a DDD Fusion. I didn't know they had a Fusion. That's really cool. Huh. Interesting. I know the person at my locals is going to be putting that deck together, so that'll be nice to see how that comes out. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So we still have an alternate rare and a secret rare, hopefully. Sometimes, like I said, they don't like to give me my ultimate rares. I don't know what the deal is that is, but hopefully we'll get it. <laughs> they're those donkey cards. Awesome. So we hold a Cyclone and a Raccoon. That's really good. Really good for me. Not so much for my friends. That's okay. <laughs> They'll have to fend for themselves. And we still have more boxes to, to open. We'll just have to hope that we pull those cards for them. Another one of those DDD cards. Looks like they have a bunch of support in this set. Getting that deck out there. That'll be really cool. Love seeing these all these new decks. The Banos is pretty harsh to a lot of the old decks. Oh. Oh nice. Starlight Red Dragon Archfiend is our secret rare. That's a beautiful looking card. It's awesome. No destroyer though for the for the friends, unfortunately. <laughs> Super expensive secret too. I kind of feel bad for them. Especially when, uh, like I said, the card costs like $130. $130 is like some people, it's a whole, a whole deck. And you need to play three of them. So it's absolutely crazy how expensive that deck is. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, two more packs to go. Still haven't pulled an ultimate rare. So hopefully, oh, here's a super rare. One of those DDD cards. And uh, Match Spectre, it's like a unicorn card. Pretty cool. <laughs> Our last pack. I don't, I don't, it doesn't look like we're going to pull an ultimate rare unless it's right here, right now. And it's an ultra rare. That's beautiful. Cool. So we ended up pulling uh, three ultra rares. Let's go see our haul. We pulled one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine foils. So we pulled a uh, one, uh, two, three ultras, the, the one secret, and one, two, three, four, five super rares. So yeah, it's a overall pretty good booster box. And I'm going to be doing one more opening before I get out the door here, and I'll be posting that. That'll be going up tomorrow. So you guys will be able to check that out. I'm going to be trying to do some vlogs while I'm out there at the event as well. So that'll be really cool. It'll be like you're there with me. Uh, on that, Jobber here is signing off.